so welcome to pv tech and in this particular video i'm going to show you how you can actually add your own cell light on your master Komo decoder if you are an installer or you are just a customer using the master decoder and with the settings on it or with a cell light you don't know how to do it or you just want to add your own cell light press on the menu on here you look for installation so installation you press ok come now to the first option which is the s2 dvd s2 second cell light second generation press ok on it and on this page you come down to the cell light list you press ok on it because you want to add the cell light so here as you can see on the screen we have some command down the screen which indicates red for delete add for green and then the yellow for the edit blue for set so you want to add your cell light so you press on the green button for the menu to pop up so you have the name you need to change the name you can just leave it as new cell light but it will be good if you change the name so that you can actually indicate that that is your cell light all right so name let's say you want to add a multi tv you can just save it multi tv so delete it save it multi tv multi tv and you press ok to save all right so when it comes to the longitude which is the degrees you can just leave it as zero zero but if you know the degrees of the slider or the tps that you need to scan in it you can just go ahead and then add so with the multi tv which is 220 degrees 0.2.1 or 28 you can just leave it as 28 which is on the east northeast and come down to save press ok on it all right so now you have your cell light but there is no tp in the cell light okay so if you want to put some tp in it here you go back like this come to the antenna settings after adding the cell light the lmb frequency in the cell light have to change so you press on the lmb frequency here and then you change it to this one 9750 all right you go back there is no tp in it there is no tp as you can see there is none of the tps in it so you go back if you want to add the tp come to the transponder list and then as you can see you have add over the green to add then here you add the multi tv tp which is one two five two five polarity vertical eighty thousand okay you press ok to save and currently i don't have multi tv signal i have only dstv signal so i need to add a dstv as well dstv tp which will be the number two so one two two four five horizontal to seven five zero zero five zero zero and you press ok all right as you can see you highlight it like this you can press on the blue button to search but if you select a search from here you won't get much of the channel so you go back to the antenna settings page where you're gonna get the tps right now all right so with a start search you change the option to either brand scan or super brand and you press ok all right so the fta only you can select yes so that it will bring up only the channels that will work it will leave the channels that have the dollar dollar size so you select yes right here if you want tv and radio you put it on all press ok to search all right so that's it you wait potentially for the scanning to complete and you got to enjoy your channel so if you find this video helpful or you got to do subscribe
like the video share and come back home thanks for watching